The French Directorate General of Armaments, DGA, announced the reception of the final lot of 10 VT-4 tactical vehicles at Standard 2, successfully completing the procurement program. The VT-4 tactical vehicle, developed by ACMET, a subsidiary of Arquis, formerly Renault Trucks Defense, was designed to replace the aging Peugeot P4 vehicles used by the French Army. This reception marks the completion of a delivery schedule that was executed in accordance with the 2019-2025 Military Programming Law (LPM), thanks to the efforts of state and industrial stakeholders. A total of 4,380 VT-4 vehicles have been delivered to the three branches of the military, the Operational Energy Service, the Joint Interministerial Service for Ammunition, SIMU, and the National Guard. The VT-4 program, also known as VLTPNP, Véhicule Léger Tactique Polyvalent, non-protégé, was initiated by the French Army to replace the aging Peugeot P4 vehicles, which had been in service since the 1980s. The French Ministry of Armed Forces placed an initial order for 1,000 VT-4 vehicles from Arquis, formerly Renault Trucks Defense, in 2016. The first examples of these vehicles were scheduled for delivery in the autumn of 2018. Subsequently, the Direction Générale de l'Armement (DGA) placed a new order on September 6, 2018, for an additional 1,200 VT-4 vehicles as part of a larger contract signed in late 2016. The overall contract aimed to acquire a total of 4,380 vehicles, out of which 3,980 were designated for the Army de Terra. This significant order was a part of the effort to renew the aging military assets of the French forces. In comparison to the previous Peugeot P4, the VT4 offers enhanced comfort and safety features, making it a significant upgrade. The vehicle comes with air conditioning and a sound insulated cabin, ensuring a more comfortable environment for the occupants during operations. Safety features such as hill start assist, descent control, anti-lock braking system ABS, and electronic stability program ESP, contribute to enhanced control and stability during road travel. The VT-4 also comes equipped with modern communication and positioning systems to support military operations effectively. It can be fitted with the CIDL, Army of the Land Information and Communications System, ensuring seamless communication between the vehicle and other units on the battlefield. Additionally, the VT-4 features two PR-4G radio stations with integrated encryption, enhancing secure communication capabilities. Furthermore, a satellite positioning system like the DAGR, Defense Advanced GPS Receiver, provides accurate location information, crucial for navigation during missions. ACMET modified the Ford Everest to create the VT-4, employing several enhancements to meet military requirements. The vehicle's height was raised to accommodate its tactical role, and controls were reinforced to increase durability in challenging environments. Hooks were added to enable air transportation, facilitating rapid deployment to various locations when needed. The VT-4, measuring 5.30 meters in length, 2.16 meters in width, 1.86 meters without mirrors, and 2.06 meters in height, has an empty weight of 2.66 tons. It has a gross vehicle weight rating, PTAC, of 3.5 tons and a gross train weight, PTRA, of 4.25 tons, with a payload capacity of 770 kilograms. The VT-4 can reach a maximum speed of 165 kilometers per hour and has a range of 800 kilometers on a single tank. Manufactured by Arquis since 2018 at their saint Nazaire facility, the VT-4 is a militarized version of the civilian Ford Everest. Key adaptations include reinforced off-road capabilities, pre-equipment for radio integration and operational information systems, as well as weapon mounts and removable glass protection. The procurement process for the VT-4 included two standards, VT-4 Standard 1, which focused primarily on mobility and underwent an upgrade to Standard 2 before 2023, and VT-4 Standard 2, deployable in stabilized foreign theaters of operation. The VT-4 serves various missions, 
including operational liaisons, securing military and sensitive facilities, and supporting training and maneuvers. The planned delivery timeline included the delivery of 500 Standard 1 vehicles between October and December 2018 and the planned delivery of the first 500 Standard 2 vehicles between September and December 2019. The VT-4 program aimed to provide a total of 4,380 inter-arm VT-4 vehicles, 500 Standard 1 and 3,880 Standard 2, to the three armed forces by the end of the Military Programming Law (LPM) in 2025. This allocation included 3,980 vehicles for the Army, 275 for the Air Force, 65 for the Navy, 40 for the Armed Forces Fuel Service (SEA) and 20 for the Joint Munitions Service CIMU. The DGA's acquisition of the VT-4 Standard II vehicles represents a significant milestone in enhancing France's defense capabilities. The collaboration between the DGA and Arquis has been integral to the success of the procurement project. The VT-4 program aims to advance the French military's mobility and operational readiness for various defense missions both domestically and internationally.